All right, back with another video. Uh, this is not going to be a break or anything. This is a uh, flea market pickup. Went to a local flea market and uh, picked up a handful of cards. Let me know what you think. So I got all these cards that I'm going to show you for three bucks. All right, and mostly one particular player. So first one I got is Dunrus. I believe this is from 1990. Uh, gosh, 1994 or something like that. Dunrus. Total bases: Frank Thomas. Insert. Numbered to five thousand. So that was one card. Next one I got is this upper deck electric diamond insert. Frank Thomas. The electric diamond have it's like a holographic uh, foil that they were printed with. And it came in this case. This is Frank Thomas. And some supply company. I don't know, but it's the regular card, the electric diamond uh, version. And I do have a little Frank Thomas PC, so just saw a bunch of these and I couldn't refuse picking them up. Next one is another insert from uh, Leaf, 1994 Leaf slideshow. And uh, these are slides in the back. You see the finger. Frank Thomas again in this uh, in this case. One of ten. That's the little sub insert set. There's ten different ones. And we got another Frank Thomas. This is from uh, Donruss. Um, hit list insert set. And it's a foil type card. And this one's numbered as well. This was uh, considered short printed in the day. 10,000. And then I picked this up. This was in there too, Frank Thomas. This is a Pinnacle Mint uh, collection. So you got the card with the circle cut out, and then you got his uh, his actual coin in there. I don't know if it's the casing. I don't know if the coin is not in good shape, but I thought it was cool. All right, and then not Frank Thomas. I got. This card, which is pretty neat. This is an insert from um, Studio, 1996 Studio, called Stained Glasses. Stained Glass insert set. This is uh, Chipper Jones. And uh, again, it's like a see through type of card all the way through. They're pretty nice looking cards. It's got a a, a nice uh, a bunch of stars in the uh, in the whole set, and then this card got this it's Griffey Jr. and Juan Gonzalez. This is one of the uh, collector's choice uh, scratch games. So if you open up this card, it's like folded in half. Open up this card, there's a picture of Griffey and Juan Gonzalez and a bunch of scratch off areas. To see if you can scratch and win. So that's what it was neat. I know I've had I've had these, but don't know where they are. And for three dollars for the whole kit and caboodle, thought it was a pretty good deal. All right, let me know what you think below. Thanks for watching.